Hello friends. Today we are going to discuss median continuous series. So for doing the median, we draw three columns. The first column is same class interval. Then the second column is frequency. And the third column is CF that is cumulative frequency. So class interval what they give same as it is 0 to 5. 5 to 10, 10 to 15, then 20 to 25. So, whatever the class interval they gave, same as it is, we are going to copy. And the frequency also will take same 7, 18, 25, 30, 20. Okay. So, this is the frequency. So, what we are going to do? First, we need to find out N. Okay. So, whenever frequency is there, we need to find out the N. So, how are we going to find out the N means? By adding all the frequency. So, 7, 18, 25, 30, 20. So, we get total is 100. Now, the next column which we are going to find it, that is CF. It is nothing but cumulative frequency. So, how you get means by adding the frequency, we get the cumulative frequency. So, what is the first value we are having? 7. So, 7 means we will write it as a 7 only. Then 7 plus 18, we get 25. Then 25 plus 25, 50. 50 plus 30, 80. 80 plus 20, it is a 100. So, one thing we need to remember whenever we are going to do the median. So, when we add the frequency, the total of the frequency and the last value of the cumulative frequency, both should be the equal. Okay. So, this is the way uh, we are going to identify whether whatever the cumulative frequency we have calculated, whether it is a right or a wrong. So, what we need to remember? So, total value of the frequency and the last value of the cumulative frequency both should be the equal. So, for doing the median continuous series, we apply the formula is median equals to size of n divided by tooth item. So, this is the one formula n divided by 2 we wrote. So, n is how much? 100. So, 100 divided by 2, we get 50th item. Okay. After this, we will write one more formula. Median equals to L plus N divided by 2 minus CF divided by F into I. This is one more formula is there. Okay, so first we apply M equals to size of N divided by tooth item. So N how much total is 100 divided by 2. So we got the 50th item. Then after that next we apply one more formula that is median equals to L plus N divided by 2 minus CF divided by F into I. So this is the one more formula we are going to apply. So now we have to see in the cumulative frequency, where the 50 will be lies. Where the 50 will be lies. So, this 50, where it will be going to lies. In 7, it will be going to come? No. In 25? No. In 50, it will be going to come the value. See, 50 means the 50 value. So, for that, we need to just underline. So, this will be your median. Median only, na? we got 50. Then this upper one every time you take it as a CF. Then this will be your frequency and this will be your L1. Okay. So after N divided by 2, whatever the value is there, that value we need to see where it will be lysing. So you will be writing as a therefore median lies in the class interval that is 
10 to 15 okay then after that where L1 equals to how much L1 is there that is 10 then n divided by 2 how much we got after uh, n divided by 2 got we got 50 so just write down 50 then cf is how much cf is 25 then frequency is 25 f equals to 25 then i is nothing but common value so 0 to 5 what common value we are getting 5 only 5 to 10 differences 5 only 10 to 15 5 only so till the 20 to 25 the common value we are getting as a 5 so i will be your your 5 now substitute in the formula median equals to 10 plus 50 minus 25 divided by 25 into 5 so m equals to 10 plus so 50 minus 25 we get 25 then 25 into 5 so median equals to 10 plus 25 into 5 so how much we get 125 then same 25 median equals to 10 plus so 125 divided by 25 we get 5 so 10 plus 50 10 plus 5 will be 15 therefore median equals to 15. So, this is the way to do the median continuous series. Thank you.